Hey, Popeye, are the latest. Good morning, Popeye. Grandma watch Popeye's every morning and every night. Good afternoon. Can you hear my mommy? So good afternoon everyone. I just want to start by saying that um, for most of you, you may already know that the remains that were found in Bella's Gate, St. Catherine, on the 15th of May, 2022, it has been confirmed that it is that of my sister, Chantel Blake, that was missing on the 6th of January. Um, I have gotten all the DMs. My family and I really appreciate the condolences. Um, some of them we have not yet gotten a chance to go through, but we really appreciate your kind words, your encouragement, and just being there on a whole. We really appreciate it, and Shanta would really appreciate it as well. So I want to thank you guys very much for keeping us in your prayers nonetheless. And helping us to share the word and you know keeping us encouraged it's very difficult it is rough and it is tough and I've never dreamt in a million years that I would be experiencing something like this or my family would be experiencing something like this if People would say, like, we've been to school and Chantel, they would say, was the quiet one. Most of the times I've gotten in trouble, it was just to protect her. And it is very sad and hurtful and painful that at this time I was not there to protect her. Because she knew I would. She knew I would. But God... But God, I knew the news could not have gone any other way because I knew from the moment that I saw the clothing that it was her because it was something that could fit. And I knew as well that it's not no coincidence that in the same community that that devil is from is the same community that my sister's remains were found. It's not coincidence. I am broken into a million pieces. When Chantel and I were growing up, we have spoken about so many things. We have never spoken about death. We have never spoken about what would happen if anything were to go around with any of us because it's not something that we even process for a second. I hold the Jamaica Constabulary Force accountable for not allowing us to have a body to bury. They could not have saved her life because I know from the moment I went to the house and I spoke with Shane McCullough that he was lying and he did something to my sister. They could not have saved her. But what they could have done was to give us a fear investigation, a just investigation so that we could at least have a body to bury. How do I go in a church with a skull and piece of bone? I hold the Jamaica Constabulary Force accountable for that. Because Chantel does not deserve this. When I went to the house and I called the detective that was on the case, that was Detective Bailey. I called him and I said to him, there's surveillance camera at the house. Has anyone checked the cameras? They're on it, they're on it, they're working on getting it. I said, has anyone questioned the children? 
up until this very moment that has not been done this is a house where this woman lives with her children and obviously she would have left the children at the house that moment she left and met her demise and no one thought about checking the surveillance camera no one thought about questioning the children when last did you see mommy did mommy say anything to you you understand me how would you describe your mom's body language they are smart children they're able to answer questions like those the excuse to that was oh they're minors of course they're minors but they can be questioned and of course you will not get the um, Shane's consent however it's a police matter that you're investigating which means that you could get a guardian involved and you could also get his attorney involved from Shantia went missing on the 6th of January Shane has done absolutely nothing to help bring her back because you know what he did he knows what he did the only thing he has done he has hired a PI to prove his innocence you could not find the time to hire a PI to prove that your what to prove what happened to your wife or to find or to locate your wife but you could hire a PI to prove that you're innocent and you could hire a lawyer to prove that you're innocent you have never come on any platform at all to say to the media to say to Jamaica my wife is missing and we need your help in trying to locate where she is because he knew what he did and he comes with the lame excuses because he knows that the system is gonna back him he knows that whatever he says or does the system is gonna back him so of course he does not need to rehearse or to study things that he's gonna come forward to say because of course he knows that the system is gonna back him because guess what him have money he's well known and he knows people in politics he knows ministers every other day you call my sister she's going to dinner with Christopher Tufton you understand I've reached out to Christopher Tufton from in February and up until now, I haven't gotten a response. Chantel is a nobody. Up until now, we have gotten no publicity as it relates to anyone coming out. We haven't gotten any statement from the DSP. No one is coming out in public saying anything to us. All the information that we have gotten is behind closed doors and information that we're searching for on our own. She is a mother of four and I would say five because Jafari does not have any other mother but Chantel. He knows no other mother but Chantel. So I would say five. But if needs be, she's a mother of four. And no one thought that something fishy right here. You understand me? Something not right right here, so. Your wife did not come home on Thursday. You, 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 you found it so much of an importance to go to the police station to make a report on Thursday that your wife is missing when you have not reached out to any other family member to ascertain if they are with her but you found it and you took it upon yourself to go to the police station and make a report not even 24 hours after you haven't seen her not even 24 hours the one person you called you did not ask if Chantel was with them you only stated Chantel is missing. Two weeks after Chantel went missing, two days after Chantel went missing, you stated on a recording that the police has, that is on social media as well, that you're grieving. Two days after your wife is missing, you're grieving. You also said to us, let us mourn together. Two days after your wife is missing, you want us to mourn together. What exactly are we mourning for? Shane Makala, what we are mourning for? What exactly are we mourning for? The Jamaica Constabulary Force see that of no importance and no urgency. But take my word for it. 
if the Jamaica Constabulary Force, Mr. Fitz Bailey, and the entire CIB and MIB allow Shane McCullough to kill my niece and nephew, you guys will be held accountable for it because that man is capable. I cannot understand why this man still have access to these children up until this very moment. I cannot understand it. I refuse to understand it. I need somebody to come and tell us publicly that, listen, since as the word adequate evidence is so much of a famous word and it's a good word, listen, we don't have adequate evidence to list him as a suspect or we have adequate evidence to list him as a suspect and let us go back to the joint board because as far as i am concerned we have been solving this case from day one we have been solving this case from day one the first time that we came public they stated that we are um, compromising the case and i say you know what mommy make we make it rest make we allow them to do them work when the remains were found I was so happy because maybe like thank you Jesus at least something will become of this and all it did was to make the case stagnant that's all it did the case stuck it can't go away after the remains were found the case stagnant remember I know this is a community that this man is from familiar with you understand me a community that her phone was also tracked the same day that she was reported missing you understand me and it's no coincidence i saw the blows and i know it was my sister's blows from the moment i look at it i knew it from the moment i set my eyes on it and to top it all off you understand when i went to the spanish town hospital and they took the remains out of the body bag the trapaulin that the body was wrapped in was nowhere to be found and they stated that they sent back for the trapaulin how could you scene of crime how could you leave trapaulin something of such significance at the scene of crime is it that you're not sensible enough is it that you're not capable enough what is it and trust me i honestly believe that that was very intentional that was very very intentional you could have left the remains there because the only thing we're going to get from the remains is to do a DNA sample from the, from the teeth. You understand? That's the only thing that we're going to get from the remains. Because there's pretty much nothing. But you left the trap hall in there. You understand that the entire body was wrapped in. Why? I want to ask that question. Why? What were you trying to cover up? I have never been so ashamed in my entire life. I have never been so ashamed in my entire life. Listen, I regret being a Jamaican citizen. And I will say that with no regret. I regret being a part of this country and this population. Because if you're not from an affluent background, if you do not have status, and if you don't have money, and if you're not in a lodge, and if you're not the wrong things, nobody notice you. Nobody notice you. I said to the first set of police that was on the case, check the surveillance camera, question the children. Jafari said to me, Auntie, are the two men them come for me? I said to the police officer, ask the little pitney, what is he talking about? Up until now. Up until now. When, when everything started off and in the initial state, my mother and I was so worried about the children. And we said to the police officer, which is Bailey and Puddy, we are very concerned about Shane leaving the island and taking the children. They said to us, that is not something for us to worry about because his travel documents were seized and the port, what did I say about the port, mommy? You know, um, it's, it, 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 there's a blockage. There's a block the at ports. him. There's a block for him at the port. So I want to know, when we got the information that Shane McCullough was in Newark, did he take the boat or did he him fly? Which one of them? Because if you take him travel documents and you close the port, me like for you know how him leave the country. And let me say this again. If Jamaica Constabulary for a sit down and make Shane kill my nieces and my nephew, because if you did that to their mother, what will you not do? You will be held accountable for it at the detriment of me. 
you will be held accountable for it. Uno too slack. Uno too corrupt. Uno too dirty. So what? Uh, Chantel not have no family. Chantel not have no family. We not have no voice. We not pay no police for do them work. Let me tell you no that. We not pay no police for do them work. Me I go tell you no that and say it straight. I pay them already in my tax money. I pay taxes so they can't you understand? Already, tax money. We have spent so much money on this. We have gotten a private investigator. And the private investigator could say to us that Shane have bodyguard, police bodyguard. You understand me? The same first set of police that had the case were the same set of police that was bodyguarding Shane. I remember speaking to this woman and I'm not going to call her name because she pretty much have never a clue. When I heard about Shane visiting a particular police bar, which is Puddy Bar. You understand? Puddy Bar. I said to the police woman, do you know Mr. Puddy? She says, yes. I say, does he have a bar? She said, yeah, he operates a bar. He owns a bar. That's confirmation. Yes, that, that is confirmation. I didn't even ask her or say anything to her about what I heard. I just wanted to know if he owns a bar for you. How do you have someone that you're investigating, quote unquote, because as far as me concerned, Shane is a victim right here. How do you have someone that you are investigating, sitting down in your bar drinking, bodyguarding the same person? Let me ask you a question. You don't have no mama, no sister, no auntie, no cousin. You don't have no relative. You don't have dirty. Nobody never did ask you to say for bring Chantel back alive to us. Because I know that Chantel dead from the moment she tell me, say, he left her off at all about 12. Because I know nothing so. We were not asking for you to bring her back alive. But because of no carelessness, you understand me? Because of no carelessness, we get skull and bone. We get skull and bone. When me tell my four niece and nephew, them say no. When me tell them say no. Because of no negligence. Because of no negligence, I'm not going to sit down and wait so she'll till she and decide to commit suicide and kill me four nieces and nephew them. Because that man is not going to allow himself to sit in jail. He may have too much ego and too much pride for that. He is not going to allow that to happen. But let me tell you this and mark my word. If she and my color, if Uno allow she and my color, if you kill my nieces and my nephew them, you guys will be held accountable for it. Because uno too, uno too neglectful. Uno too neglectful. Uno take up what for serve and protect. Uno need to put in a bracket wealthy, affluent people. Because only them the people they want to protect. Only them the people they want to protect. The wealthy people them, the affluent people them, the people that want to can get a drink from. Only them the people that want to protect. Mr. Fitzbelly, I am so disappointed in you. Because I came to your office and you gave me your word that you will be investigating the matter personally. It is not something that you do. But you're going to ensure that you take up this case as a, on a personal level. And quite frankly, you've done nothing. When the MID took this case... I think they have tried their best. But you see CID and you see Matilda's kind of police and them compromise the case. The matter about we going on social media go compromise and them compromise the case because they made it so difficult. All the evidence that was there. Three months later, MID take control. If so much. Don't hold me to that. You understand me? It was so difficult. There was no security footage. And as far as me concerned, Chantel is dead and the children are missing, probably dead. Because nobody can say to us, listen, we have spoken to the children and they're okay. You understand? Nobody can say that to us. Every time that we make a phone call, if we do get through, the matter is under investigation. The matter is under investigation. Shane has been treated like he's a victim. When you're the last person we see her, you understand me? You are the husband, you understand me? And your story is not adding up. They couldn't even get him to come identify the clothes. You could not even get him to come identify the clothes. And he's the last person that saw her. And you could not get him to do that. And yet still, this man is being treated as if he's a victim.
all the Jamaica constable your friends did need to tell we is that like guess what you know, take up some placard and some poster and come down here come make up some nice and get TVJ and CVM I would have done that cause that could have been done that could have been done a vulgar is then like how they used to but we honestly feel like say if you take a word for serve and protect that is exactly what you should be doing I mean, I said this with what I I regret being a Jamaican citizen. I regret being a part of this population. Because I never pay, we couldn't pay people to. But we not support no corruption. We not support it. We not support no corruption. Uno to wicked. Uno to wicked. Uno sit down on the eye ass and know exactly where this man do. And instead of uno action where this man do. Protect we. You understand me? Make we feel like say yes, something is being done and we're getting justice. Uno cover it up. Uno cover it up. Three months after my sister go missing. Or months after. Una go go by us. Forgo for do what? Exactly. What I go by the house at this point, go do. What not expect to see up there? When you see a man call she and tell him say them all come and he must clear out everything. What exactly you guys expecting to see months later? Me beg you no, look on the surveillance camera. You understand me? Match timestamp. Check if this goes off it true. What time him say she leave the house? All right, look on the surveillance camera and match what the man I say. Nothing is wrong if he was proven innocent. But there was nothing done. And there could not be anybody else because Chantel don't know nobody. She had make sure say Chantel don't know anybody. Because he makes sure he said him depart her from the entire family. Mother, father's mother and father's side. He makes sure he said incomplete that assignment. But let me tell you something, Shane. You get it wrong. Because if you feel like you could have brainwashed Chantel into me hating her and me sitting down and accept what you do, you got it twisted. You got it twisted. You understand me? You go up a uh, uh, Matilda's corner police go tell them whatever you want to tell them and make report. Not even 24 hours after your claim say your wife go missing. You go up there go make report. Before you ask her, You understand me? You, you not call her soul and ask them. You don't hear from Sean. You don't see Sean. Sean not come home you know. But you call and say Sean is missing. And you're grieving. And you're mourning. The very moment they went by the house. The same day after you left the country. Remind me about the Saturday when you run. You know why I did run. You understand? Remind me when I came run. by the house on Saturday, that was the 8th of January. When I came by the house, I called you and said, listen, I come up there. You understand me? And I was at the house and I had to go to work. You got a phone call and you had to leave immediately. All you answered the phone and said is, me come, me come. Me said to the police them, check the man phone records of who that call him. Who that call him? Why him a fi run? Him couldn't drop me out of the front for me get a taxi for go work. Because somebody call him. You understand me? I said to the police, check his phone records. This man had about three different number. Check his phone records. Who him a talk to? Who is he talking to? You mean me a come, me a come. That's all he said. The, the phone call was not 10 seconds. And he could not drop me at the front of the scheme to get a taxi to work because he had to leave so urgently. So urgently. We sat down and he grieved with soul and he pain with heart. But we sat down and we allowed the Jamaica Constabulary Force to do them work. And they make mockery away. Mm. They made mockery of us because they know that they weren't doing shit. They knew that they weren't doing anything and then take with a fool and take with a puppy show. Because what? Because what? She ain't come tell you to say Chantel and the family not live so good because he make sure the same assignment was completed. He make sure the same assignment was completed. That's why you never like me. Because you know say a Chantel are the weak one. That's why you never like me. I always wonder, you don't know nothing about me, but yet still you don't like me. You tell Chantel, all man have evil about me and you don't know me. But you realize, say, you have a challenge. You're by you, man. You have a challenge. 
But you get it twisted if you feel like say the brainwash your brainwash Chantel. I gonna make me sit down and allow you to go scotch free. You understand me? Me disappointed in Jamaica. No one has came to us publicly and said anything. You understand me? The only time we get results is when we go up on social media or when the media is involved. Because Chantel and nobody and fear our family no count because they not no money. They not no money so fear our family no count. She not no, she not no celebrity. She not no influencer. So fear what they must say no really make no sense right here so. We not business with what they must come with. We not too corrupt in other country. Yeah. Finish more, I don't need for this side whether or not Jamaica need a justice system or they need JCF. Cause me not think right now it necessary. Me not think it necessary. Me not think it necessary. Because we don't serve and protect. Me not know how in a million years me dream that me did want to be one police. Me not know how me did come of that. Only is a wicked set of people. You understand me? Only is a wicked set of people. And let me tell you, this case was compromised from the first set of police to have the case. And me need Fitz Bailey for ask Bailey and Puddy why it is that the security camera was not checked. Why it is that up until this point there is no no um location of where the kids are and the kids were not questioned up to this point. Three months later is when the real investigation I would say started. Three months later. And then couldn't do nothing about it. Um, 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 MID couldn't do nothing because the damage was already done. The damage was already done. What could MID do? They tried. They tried because when the, the, the detective from MID called me and if that man would research his memory, I thought he was a scammer. Because I called my mother, Mr. Mumu, I don't believe that man. Yeah. Because he came and he was very empathetic. He was a very empathetic. And I could not believe it. And I said to Mumu, Mumu, that man is a scammer. And, when I went to and, I, and I said to him, I called a friend of mine and I said, how can I verify that a police officer is indeed a police officer? And he said to me, ask him for his badge number. So I said, is that something that you would actually give to me? And he said, yeah, he has to give it to you. And I text the police officer and I said, what is your badge number? And he gave it to me and I sent it back to that person. And I said, this badge number looks familiar. This sound so like somewhere exists. And he said, yes. Because he knows persons and their badge number is very similar. I thought it was a scam because he was the only one that was empathizing. And when you went to the office, it was the same thing. So it wasn't just not that one individual. Exactly. And when we went to MID, they were very, very empathetic. They were very empathetic. But when you come on to Matilda's corner and CIB, I this is the corruption day. And when me tell you something, one man cannot change the world. And if the head corrupt, me don't know where the foot for do. You understand me? If the head corrupt, I don't know what the foot should do. And we are not stupid. We sit down and we nod our heads and we bite with finger near me. couldn't feel like say we're dumb, but we're not dumb. Enough is enough. And me would have liked somebody to tell me how when Shane McCullough is going to be listed as a prime suspect and how when me going to get my niece and nephew them out of that man custody. Because if the Jamaica Constabulary for a sit down and allow Shane to hurt my nieces and nephew, they will be held accountable for it. Because there are other things that they're going to be held accountable for. Like not allowing us to have a body to bury. If they had done their investigation initially, we would have gotten a body to bury. We now pay nobody for do them work. Let me set that Again, straight. No? Pay them already. We now pay nobody for do them work. Cause we know some money issue. I don't know if not broke, now maybe. And we not broke more than nobody else. And I broke, we broke. We just not believe in the corruption. So we want Mr. Fitz Bailey go back to the drawing board with the first set of police them we did have the case and ask them how much money you no get. Give back she any money. So we can get justice. Because Chantel life matter too. Chantel life matter too. 
So uno 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 go do on do and give back she any money. So cause Chantel life matter. You couldn't hire one team for go search for your wife. You couldn't go in your vehicle and drive couldn't go all over for sure with auntie where you left the remains. But you could have hire PI and police and, and, and police and lawyer. And when police ready for question, your papa, you come talk about say you have memory problem. You not have memory problem yet. Me say, well, I don't ask I go catch fire because I'm not stopping. I am not stopping. Uno too wicked. Uno too wicked. Okay. Chantel don't deserve this. You finished that. Never message for the Prime Minister. Sure, mommy. Chantel don't deserve this. We never did I ask the police to boom flick pan their head and do nothing where they're supposed to do. All we are asking for is justice and a thorough investigation. That's all we needed. That's all we needed. And we were going to do a protest today. But because it was sudden, and I know that there's a lot of people that would want to be a part of it, postpone it for further dates. You understand me? And we still have time to give us answers. I mean, I want nobody call my phone and come tell me no rock me want it public. Same like how you can go sit around big table and talk about you have adequate evidence. Me need it public to say, look here, we have adequate evidence that Shane is not a suspect we or we have adequate evidence that Shane is a suspect. And if Shane is not a suspect, tell me who is a suspect because no Chantel kill herself and make dog nyamar. So I want to know who is the suspect. I don't give she in time to fly all about the country and all about the island. I don't give him time to fly and make him do nothing to one of my niece and nephew them. I don't allow him to do nothing to one of my niece and nephew them. Enough is enough and people tired and sick of uno. People tired and sick of uno. I don't take people's life with papi sure. You understand? All because you can't get one dollar. All because you can't get something out of the pocket. You don't take people life for puppy show. And two people now appear, you know. You understand me? And two people now have not, 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 not affluent background. And two when a politician. And two when I go up and dinner with no minister. It no matter. Chantel life no matter. But I said this already, I'm going to say it again. If the Jamaica Constabulary Force, Andrew Owens. Mr. Fitz Bailey, allow Shane McCullough. Chris because, Chang. listen, Horace Chang, allow Shane McCullough if you do anything to my nieces and nephew there, we'll have to answer to the family. And you guys will be held accountable for it if it's the last thing I do. Because we're too slack in other country. Yeah. That's why so much disaster come down here. Yeah. Because I want to see them and I sacrifice people in other country for no wealth. We're too sickening. Me tired. You understand me? Me tired. Chantel life matter too. She have four picnic when need answers. Four picnic where them entire life damaged for the rest for as long as Brett Brown and them body. Just say they will never two. be the same. Just say is only two. The baby is two years old. Good they not even got no mother. You understand me? You have so much, but yet you have nothing. What exactly are you doing? And Mr. Puddy, why she ain't sitting at your bar when you are investigating? Why? And why would you tell we say she and travel documents are seized when nothing of us are? Why would you tell with that? Can I take with you a fool? And there's a block at the port. And there's a block at the port. So I must fly in fly left here then, because no boat neither. Uno sickening. And if me did have a way to give up my citizenship for this country without a doubt, me no want be a part of uno. Me no want be a part of the population. Uno sick me. Uno only give justice to people we have we have money. You understand me? Uno only give justice to people we have money. You see how quick we reach down a Clarendon? You see how quick we reach down a Clarendon because the boy we do the act on nobody. And I know nobody no call we answer. Listen, my condolences to the family. 
You understand me? This is what we're doing. This is not what we're doing. We have to call to get information. Nobody is coming out publicly. Nobody. Because she ain't big in her politics. When in when in their own PMP, my PMP, and when in their own JLP, my JLP. And in no smuddy when no smuddy. And in no smuddy when no smuddy when no smuddy when no smuddy. Chantel is somebody and she have family. She has family. You understand me? You come a country when we just left high school, she and, and you come up at Ginger Ridge. And you see Chantel. You understand me? And your sister, she fool. And your sister, she fool fool. Come in and ask no question, Chantel. Only thing Chantel good pan is the book. You understand me? Your sister, she fool fool. Make anybody, make anybody like me. I should have me. Make anybody like me. Your sister, she weak. And your sister, she's easily manipulated. Easily manipulated. And your brainwasher, your brainwasher, your brainwasher. You give her four pitney and then tell her she's not no memory. Because she have too much pitney. Because she have too much pitney and you give her them. And yet, cost her, tell her she's not no memory. You understand me? You sick me. And listen, me, this no surprise me. Because Chantel probably tell you, the last time I talk to Chantel, I tell her, say, you're going to kill her. I say, Chantel, if you don't stop what you do with Shane, and if you don't stop cover up for Shane, and stop make Shane control your life, I'm going to kill you. You understand me? Because the first thing you start do is separate her from your family because you have a plan. First sign of abuse. You have a plan and you have an, you have an intention. Have an agenda. But it now go go so. It now go go so. I mean, I get the Jamaica Constabulary Force, Horace Chang, Andrew Owens, Fitz Bailey. Time to come to the family and make we know exactly what is going on and who is the main suspect. We would have liked to know that. Come in, no sure, say, I shan't take herself and make that. Nyamar. You understand me? And if you don't have no suspect seven months after, you don't need to go quit on a job because you're not capable. You're not capable because he's not a police. I mean, know exactly what happened. You're not capable. And I refuse to believe that you're not capable. You just don't want to do it because the family and not vice because we're poor. Because we're not going to pay you two times for doing the work. Lies, pant up a lies, pant up a lies. You understand me? Cause you know why we feel comfortable and feel like we know how to do something. Lies, pant up a lies, pant up a lies. We to take it for one big puppy show. Yesterday, day before yesterday, I went on Facebook and I made a po post about, um, is it that we will not cook up with the DNA? Why the DNA taking so long? You understand me? Not even 24 hours later, we can come back with result. Early in a day, so on work overtime. Last night. On work overtime. Forget the DNA result. I want to smell the rat. Which one? Not even 24 hours after I went on social media asking why the DNA result taking so long. We want to have a cook up. We want to make sure you turn off his stove and can tell with the truth. Because on work overtime. The DNA result was sitting there all along. And me would have liked somebody to tell me what was taking so long. What was taking so long? You understand me? People have to go up on social media for act out of their character for no do work. For no do on a job. You have to be forced to do on a job before people can get justice in another, justice in another country. I wait for. What is it for? It's not needed then. Because if we ever go out there and solve the one case and get justice for yeah, yeah. one brother or sister, it don't make no sense. You hear what somebody say? What? They made it look like she was tired of her family. And that all the, that she, that mm -hmm. all the reporter she didn't get a Yeah. She, she tired of her runway. And let me tell you now, she ain't make sure God the police station go make him report because him couldn't make we make the report. Because after he made the report, he knew damn well that we could not go again and make another report. You understand me? He knew that, that we could not go ahead and make another report after him go make film report. Mr. The baby said to me, Auntie, are the two man them come for me? Me drive round the hospital them in a Kingston. 
just a find out if something happened to her and she's admitted. Because I know in my head that she ain't do something to her, but I refuse to believe that she is so wicked. You understand me? I refuse to believe that she is so wicked. And the little boy come here, little boy say, Auntie, grandma, they are crying, and he's a two man and come for mommy, he's a two man and come for mommy. And we went processing at it at the time because everybody in them emotions, and we are thinking about one million things, and we ain't thinking straight. Fire of the body. Social media police, it is a shame for no say you have to go on social media, you cannot go into an office and speak with the person, and we say them have integrity. The people never said that they are for the people of the people. I promise to protect. I promise to protect and serve. You cannot leave matters. You cannot give it to them. And you cannot trust them. When they called my mother to do the DNA sample, my mother had to travel out of her parish. And pay people for, and going, pay people for going with her. Because she not trust her. My dear road me I watch my back. I may not trust her. Because you don't see him when I go tell you to do this and then you don't see him when I go set we up. Me I go see how long. Me I go sit and wait and see how long before Shane is going to be listed and taken into custody. Because you are the last person who see her. You is her husband. And as far as me concerned, you claim to say that she was having an affair. You don't need no other reason for have him as a suspect. No other reason you don't need. More ever. More ever. Which part of the remains were found is the community that you're from. Same place where they track your phone. So me would have liked to ask the Jamaica Constabulary Force what is the hold up? What is the hold up? I am not sure if she was well or wasn't well. That's based on what we heard. But if she was not well, it would be the perfect time for him to do what he had to do. Because Chantel is not going down without a fight. As much as she going like she dark, she's not going down without a fight. And she has to fight for her pity them for the loss of her. Imagine how my sister cry for her life. Shane. Dr. Shane. Imagine how my sister beg you for the sake of her pity them. How you feel when you're looking at pitting them face and know say you kill them mother? How you feel? And the family them where you have a back yo, and the worker them where you have a back yo. Me say I plead the blood of Jesus pan uno. Me say I set fire pan uno ass. I set fire up on uno. Uno too unjust and corrupt. She tell us somebody and I break blow in her body before she and take you away. I miss God. You understand me? Uno too sickening in another place here. Uno too sickening. Me never see a country me eat so. Me prefer go US, make them do racism against, racism against me. Me prefer that. But me can't be amongst my own black people and I decide something you are going. Then you have something you are going. As me said before, we never did that ask the Jamaica Constabulary for us to give back Chantel alive because we know that not possible. We know that not possible. Just All we wanted was a thorough investigation. And a body. And a body. We uno no make we get. Because I want a negligence. Because I want a negligence. I want to drown a foot. Because I want to say I want a friend. I want to can't get work for do. I want to can't get money now in the pocket. So I want to drag on a foot. Because the black family now have nothing for go no. More than call up on the name. The black family now have nothing to forgive you no. But you only can get one little stipend. You only can get one little work do. That's all that matters. I saw my sister life boil down to. Me want to ask Mr. Bailey. You said that you have adequate evidence to take Noel into custody for 13 days. So I would like to ask you. What, God, what, what do God, you God. have? What has gone in a seven months? Seven months you get, and what do you have on Shane McCullough? What do you have for seven months? 
But for 13 days, because you start getting nervous, because people are calling on him. When you start getting nervous and say, no, man, I could do something, because I'm call now. You understand me? When you start getting nervous, I saw people have to get answer in another country. You understand me? People have to start calling him. Put them life in a danger before people can get answers in another corrupt place here. Yeah. It is heartbreaking for no say. For no say a case as clear cut as this. This is where it revert to. This is where it revert to. This is what it revert to. A, a case that is so clear cut. This man upon record in the same grieve. He not have the time to carry the family member to where him drop off him wife. Till next week. Till next week. If I believed you for a second that you took Chantel to hold her but told me not left this so. But liar Shane, wicked Shane, me no said nothing no go so. That's why me no go down there. And you won't have the time to do that until next week. Day after police go up at your house. You fly out. Where you run for? Where you run from? Who you run from? Why are you running? The justice system has failed Chantel another time. Another time. Because that's all you do. That's what you do best. That's what you know the best. You feel like them something you could have gone in America? This man is the last person that saw her. He's her husband. He's known to be abusive. And he stated that she's having an affair. What else do you need for this man to be listed as a suspect? What else? What else do you need? And know that it has been confirmed that the remains that were found in Bella's Gate, same place which part of the boy come from, is that of Chantel Blake. I would like to know what is the hold up and what is the step moving forward. Is it that we still not have enough evidence? Adequate evidence. I would like to know. Uno is a set up. Listen, this country only belongs to animal. No human being no need for Livia. Me shame of my nationality. I'm going to say that. I'm going to say it again. I am ashamed of my nationality because of the justice system and the people that we have as the head and the people that we have in authority. Me shame of my, of my, of my citizenship of this country. What the hell is left for us to do? You understand me? It has been bad enough so we're not going to see her again. It is already bad enough so we're not going to see her again. When I hear that man say we have adequate evidence <laughs> to take Noel into custody, at the mercy of God, make me not have heart attack. I buy the food and I couldn't eat the food. Come here, say, Mommy, adequate evidence? Bad to bad. Them not find the girl body yet. And I hope our family gets some closure just to see him. And you have this man in a custody. You find Chantel body now. You confirm say she know. And you confirm say which party happened. The same place where the boy come from. Same place where you track him for on the same day. Me I go see how long it going to take for this brother be listed as a prime suspect. And go and get into lock up. And he's in police custody. Me I go see how long that's going to take. Another seven months probably. Another seven months probably. Nobody has reached out to us. Me see them big pan TV. I said, we're going to investigate. We're gonna, nobody has done anything about this case publicly. Nobody. Because Chantel and nobody. 
She ain't nobody. Her family small. Them not well known. We not really know them. And we broke. And we broke. We not get nothing from them, so we not go waste your time. And we not call nobody near. We not get nobody nervous. So no urgency in the panda side here. The Jamaican citizens do a better job in investigating than the JCF. Because I feel like say a JCF go lock up Noel. And the Jamaican citizen why this man is in, in lock up. The JCF did nothing. And let me say this again. If Jamaica Constabulary Force, Horace Chang, Fitz Bailey, Andrew Oness, sit down and allow Shane to hurt my nieces and my nephew, you will be held accountable for it. For if I the last thing me do, you will be held accountable for it because on a, on, on a toad, neglectful. I will not drown for too long now. You will be held accountable because of negligence. She ain't full of too much pride. In full of too much ego. Him now go stand up and make him and see say him go get locked up and go to prison. He have too much pride. And me I said this to Jamaica. Me I said this to the Jamaica Constabulary Force. Uno sit down and make she and hurt my nieces and my nephew. Uno sit down and wait for it to happen. Because me I go, me I go want ear want to have at this point. Me I go want ear want to have at this point. When I call Mr. Bailey, the first set of police that were on the case, when I called him. And I said to him, what was it that Shane reported at the station? He said to me, what did he tell you? I gave him the first story about the lawyer office. He said, that's not it. And I gave him the second story about the exit at Old Abatol. And he said, yes, that is the, 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 the statement that was given. And I said to him, something is not right because why you give me two, three different stories? You can't drop her off at three different places. The man said to me, say, I'm going to call me back. And when you hang up the phone with me, I'm going to call. Tell about the flyer where you met. I'm going to call. You're missing person. Flyer. If you guys were to go back and take a look at it, the first flyer I made... I put on the flyer that Shanta was last seen in the Kingston area because remember this man said he took her to the lawyer's office. When I did the flyer up at the house Friday night, I showed it to him and I showed it to his father. Them look on the flyer about two minutes and say, yeah man, that good. So Shane, let me ask you. How comes it is that you took her to the exit at Old Arbor Tool? And when I put on the fire that she was last seen in the Kingston area, it never sparked you. If you said to me, say, remember, say, I never Kingston. You agreed to it. And you gave me your consent to make the flyer public. And none of that, none of that not support anything. There still is, there still is not enough evidence. Madness. Every time this man open up his mouth, him talk or him, him, son, him son more guilty and him sink himself. But he can't say anything because he know the system I go back him. He knows how to get out. So he can't say anything because he know that the system is going to back him. You claim to say she, she, her friend was going to pick her up. She ain't gonna leave Shante no way for nobody. You need to make Shante come here by herself. Our Hello? Our friend. Exactly. Which friend? Musi Pasta. Which friend? Musi Pasta. And the pastor woman they will come talk about say Shante tell her say we keep the children them till she come back. You have to go to prison. Ah hell. Which part she tell us say she a go? On a profess Christianity on a devil. Which part she tell us say she a go? Wicked Karen. What she tell us say she a go? I want me to call back your phone, girl, you're not answer. But you're not Christian and you're not have church. I say, hell fire for you, burn you know. When I call your phone to talk to the children, them, you tell me, say, them going to church, I must call back 9 o'clock. When I call your phone 9 o'clock, you're not answer. And you've never answered since. When I shanty call you, 
You got to talk about say we are making this work because worse because you're helping the family. And Chantel said that you should stay with the kids and keep the kids until she comes back. Which by your senar? Where are you senar? Which by your senar? You understand me? This is a man with weeks after time wife went, went missing. He might walk up and down with Iki Panek. Iki Panek. Move out time house. Gone in a different community. Take off her name off. Take off her name off of every name. Jesus Christ thing where him have. Fly out, go sell the property. Fly out, go sell the property where they are Georgia. We know it all. Where urgency for? Where urgency for? I don't mean a life, you know. Where the urgency for? You don't have no urgency if you go put a team together if you go find your wife. You don't have no urgency if you go up on no platform at all. If you mention that your wife is missing. But you have urgency if you fly a foreign if you go sell house. You have urgency if you get lawyer. And you have urgency if you get PI. I said why did my car turn over power of attorney to him? For yeah. Million. And why you make sure turn over power of attorney to you for the house in Georgia? Where the urgency for? You had in your agenda. It what is the agenda. urgency for? And up until now. Me not understand why you, you have so much freedom. Why do you have so much liberty if you can't travel up and down, up and down, up and down? Me would I let Jamaica constabulary force if you make me understand that the part. When I, you are a husband, you understand me? You are the last person with CR, you understand me? And your story is not adding up. And why Detective Bailey and Puddy lied to us, telling us that his travel documents were seized when not number so. And there's a block at and the there's port. a block at the port. Lies. And Puddy, remember, you are the one that said to me that you tell Shane that he should get a lawyer. Yes. Why? Yeah. In preparing. Because I know, you know, understand. Why would you prepare someone like that? Because once him get a lawyer, that is it. Yeah, you you cannot get through to him with it without his lawyer. So how is it that before. you are a police officer and you're gonna say to call this him man, him phone, you know, not in person. call him on the phone and tell him that he needs to get a lawyer? So you're preparing him for what? Why? When I went to Matilda's corner police station the Sunday, because from me leave the house the Friday, Detective Bailey not answering him phone. And surprisingly, as me leave Matilda's police corner the Sunday, him answer him phone. As a matter of fact, him call me. You understand me? I go tell me about all oh, them check hotel and them check this. You find all time to go to hotel, but you couldn't check the surveillance camera where they had the house. How for intelligence you work off of? Whose intelligence are you working off? Because you don't have intelligence. If you know, say, you need to check the surveillance camera at the house, but you're going to drive up and down a check hotel, like your book or somewhere. But I'm going to investigate a few of I'm, 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 I'm And why is Shane now. seen at Puddy's bar? So Puddy, you need to make you know if you don't have no bar or if you have a bar. You understand? And it has been confirmed that you have a bar. So me would like to know why it is that you are the investigator on the case and this man is seen at your bar. Why? Jamaica Constabulary Force need to lift up and make people get justice or them want get justice and leave things to God or go chant or do something because it doesn't make no sense. We don't make no sense. We don't need to get our local corner and just make people know, say, look here, once you have money, come over here. If you don't have money, go over there. So, based on your status, it determines the type of justice that you get in this country. Your status determines the type of justice that you get in this country. Can nobody need glass for Sissy? Chantel did not go missing in a normal circumstance. And anybody when was Shane McCalla no say if Chantel went missing on a normal circumstances, he would have moved mountains. He would have moved mountains and you did absolutely nothing. And I want the police to ask you 
Why Chantel phone went missing and mysteriously appeared? I'm going to leave it right there, so. Mm -mm. Why Chantel phone went missing and mysteriously appeared and it was white? white. Why? And I'm going to leave that right there. Two weeks our phone got missing for. And when the phone mysteriously appeared, wipe, brand new. I am sick and tired of this justice system. I'm sick and tired of the people in this country where we rely on for help we and give us answers. You understand me? This is too much. It is too much. Jamaica too small for all of them something you are going. Jamaica too small for all of them something you are going. People need justice regardless of them status or them social background. People need justice. Chantel is somebody. And she's a mother of four. She's a sister. She's a mother. She's a child. She's an auntie. She's a cousin. And she's a friend. Well, maybe too few, because trust me, she ain't no make she talk to nobody. I will when I find her granddaughter. There are persons that can witness to Shane being abusive. There was one person that commented on one of my posts stating that Chantel came to work, come, came to school. That was in NCU. And one was the pan our body from one of the pan our body. And that not spark nobody, because Shane can do what he does and gets away with it because he knows that the system will back him. He knows that the system will back him and he can do anything and say anything because the system has his back. So, who have Fui back? Prime Minister Andrew Holness, who have Fui back? Who are going to listen to us? Who can we speak with? Who is going to be honest and just and actually do what they are called to do? And do what people vote them for do. Who? Get rid of the JLP government. This country don't need no government. Everybody need to depend on them free will. This country don't need no JCF. They don't need no government. They don't need nothing. Because it doesn't make a difference. It does not make a difference. Chantel is somebody's child. And Jamaica can start stable first. I will never forgive you for having us. Having us have to deal with a skull and peace of one. Because of a negligence. Because of a negligence. And I was prepared for you guys to come and tell us that the DNA result shows that it is not her. No, but you know, realize, okay. say. No, but in the real I say, God is more powerful. God is more powerful. You understand me? And after I made the social media post, after I did that interview with Popeye, or Papi, Papi. Name, Papi, not even 24 hours after, oh, with DNA results are in. Overnight. Overnight, on the work. Hello? Overnight, on the work. On the sit on the panel, cook it up. Fi say all right then. Them now ask about it. Them them can't bother. All right, I'm gonna tell them this. You know, sick. And them did right, but that fits barely give them away. You know, sick. Because there's more than adequate evidence to have Shane McCalla in custody. And that wake we up. And me say when me hear the word adequate evidence, me say the mercy of God. Because all we based upon full understanding, the only thing while Shane in custody is because there's nobody. So I would like to know, now that there's a body, well, there's some remains, I would like to know what is the hold up. But I said this already, I'm going to say it again. If the Jamaica Constabulary first allows Shane to make anything happen to my nieces and my nephew, you will be held accountable for it. Because of negligence. The first 48 hours of a missing person is the most vital part of a missing person case. And in the first 48 hours, when a sit on a drag on a foot, ain't doing crap. Ain't doing crap. Three months after, you know what MID for God do. You know what MID for God do, where only God work. can do. Clean up and dirty work. You understand? You know what MID for God do, only where God can do. 
three months later if you had done your job in the initial state cib matilda's police corner we would not be dealing with the mid their help would not be needed it would not be necessary maybe dna was hard to get because it's just skull and bones miss they took my dna me, me, me they know they took my dna and take remains from the um bone marrow never hard for them dna just need bone marrow that's what they took bone marrow from the bone and dig up dig up my mouth are you used the the the, denti the dental no, no, but must say about DNA, hard to find because that's the easiest dental. thing to get a dna dental dental records You understand me? And is and is and listen, it is no coincidence again, because obviously I'll be a coincidence. It is no coincidence again that after I made that post on social media, after I did that interview, not even 24 hours later, surprisingly, the DNA result is in. It is no coincidence when you have it sit on a long time. I try to cook up one hotel, we're not trying to wait for the right time, but to realize that God bigger than this. God bigger than Uno. And he knows that we couldn't take that the news. Cause I know me I got dead. Any omitted did hear say that remains was not my sister. Me a dead same place. Me not ask. Because I square one we gone back and I could not take it. I could not do it. Uno fail with big time. Gonna fail with big time because this could have been done with a long time ago. This could have been done with a long time ago. And every day me sit down and me think about Jaden, Josiah, Jada, Jessia. It pain me out because me know that the kids are in danger. And the only person when I see that are the JCF. The only people that saw that the children were not in danger is the JCF. And we have no idea where the kids are up to this point. Up to this point, no idea where the children are. And nobody can tell us where the children are. If they had questioned the kids in the initial state, you understand me? Nobody has to go interrogate the poor people in them. All I'm saying is the children are very innocent and they're not gonna lie and they cannot outsmart a police. Ask them, when last did you see mommy? Did mommy say anything to you? Did mommy pack anything? Who did mommy leave the house with? What did she say when she was leaving? What did she say when she was leaving? Who did she leave with? Very important and I know that's not done. I'm busy. And to top it all off, I said to Bailey and Puddy, check the surveillance camera. When I called Bailey and I said to him, has anyone tracked her device? Has anyone picked up any satellite on his phone? You know what this man said to me? One puppy shrimp take me for? I'm right here. Saturday. He said this to me. This would have been the, the eighth. Are some of me? Yeah. Yeah, man. Six. The eighth. Yeah. I didn't, one of them days there. Yeah, man. Six I went to make report I missed Thursday. He Friday, said to Friday. me that he's refreshing his email, waiting on the result from the tracking of our device. And you know damn well not no go so. You know damn well nothing like that. And you tell me say you're sitting down refreshing your email, waiting on the result for the tracking of our device when you know not no go so. What else do you need? What else do you need? Like, what else do you guys need? She and a, a Rome Street. You understand me? In my chain and Joe, near motor, everything. You understand me? In my fly out. In my sell out. In have all of them the freedom day. All of them the freedom day. And right now, if McCall and ask the Jamaica Constabulary for it, where Shane McCullough, they don't know. But yet still, they have an eye on him. 
they said they can't um, take away traveling documents, but they have, what is up name on him? And that just mean I? Yeah, yeah, they have an I on him. But how we have to tell him when they mean a New York yeah. airport? Yeah, and how we have to call them, tell them, say, him the New York. But they have an eye on him. I must not big enough. What do you want, mommy? You want some food? I don't have food. They have an eye on him. Give me a little give me light. You understand? They have an eye on him. And and if I call them right now and ask them, where is Shane? Where are the children? They don't know. They cannot answer the question as a matter of fact. Is if if I'm me alone, me I go out at CIB, I me I go go with my poster them, I me I go go with my placard, I me I go ask the question them. Cause I need somebody for answer me. I need somebody for answer me publicly. Cause me would I like for no? If Chantel not somebody, if fear life don't matter to nobody. It's true we not having money and true we not pay off nobody and we not pay nobody for do them work. It no matter. And we don't know nobody. And we don't know nobody. It no matter. Cause we not have a voice. Come on, you say they are foreign. Of course him they are foreign. We know saying they are foreign. He left your friend the day them this day after they went by his house. He left the country. Why did he have that freedom? Why was he given that freedom? Why was he given that freedom to leave the country? And where y'all left your country go? Your wife missing. Quote and quote in your words. Where y'all go? You send her got foreign? Where y'all got foreign go do? You not steer your man and try find her? Where y'all got foreign go do? You're busy at sell house. You're busy at change your name. You're busy at change your bank account. You understand? <laughs> All about you there. All about you there. Not even we have the freedom where you have, because we're scared. My shopping documents are sending. We're scared. And all about you there. Because you're a victim. You are a victim. And your wife has been taken from you. And thin hair has taken her away. What is the excuse? No. What is the hold up? No. What is the hold up now? When it sick me to my stomach. Because you could have done better. Jamaica Constabulary Force, you could have been be done better. The justice system could have done better. Mr. Fitzbilly, you could have done better. But because we never get no now no nervous. True, we never unfold now no dirty days. We don't know business, boy. But as soon as people start calling the name, and as soon as we start getting nervous at the time, they don't start doing work. Because people have to force you to do a job. I don't talk about a Christian or a pastor. They say if God could have strike someone, if God could have dumb someone, we don't come talk about Christian. Mr. Tuftan, this man is close to you. I don't know if not, but not maybe. You understand me? I message you directly. And I'll know you're not answer me. I'll know. Because I know that this man is your buddy. I know he's your bestie. And we are seeking assistance in speaking to this man so that we can get justice for my sister. And I'll know you're not respond. The next time you're just buddy, we did want to know. And that's the body we did not look for. There was nothing else that we were asking for a moment because we know she did. The only thing that could keep Chantel away from our children for a day is death. The only thing that would keep Chantel away from our children for a day is death. Somebody said they never liked the idea of she married to Chantel in the first place. I just said, how never even know about it? When exactly. When Chantel get married, she tell her not to tell me. She ain't tell her not to tell me. Chantel called me the morning. That she the morning before our wedding and tell me she she'll get married. And I was so upset and I felt so disrespected. And I said, I would never do this to you. I'm in a reformer, I would never do this to you if it were me. But I hold nothing against her because I know it was her wasn't her doing. When Chantel tell me, say, 
she had paid the baby mother, which is Jafari mother, a million dollars for left him so that he can be with her. I said to her, Chantel, do not talk to this man because he's going to do you the same thing or even worse. How much money you pay the people them for kill her? How much money you pay the people them for kill her and pay the police them for shut them out and not do no work? We to her, How say, much money? Remember when we said to her, say, he might go take my opinion and like when take with Jafari and she said, he might go kill me? Mm-hmm. How much money? Me tell her. You understand me? When she ain't coming at the family, come like a destruction. Destruction. Everybody apart. Destruction. Both sides. Me said to Chantel, say, Chantel, you cannot be with a man when not even once man in your family cannot give you the blessing. Me said, me can't tell her what to do, but I would not do it. And in brainwash her, in take her, and him do the first thing for capture, which is to get her pregnant. And he did it while she was in school at NCU because he knows that he had a fish. He continue to go to school after he married her. Him and a fool, you know? Perfect agenda. Perfect agenda him have. And then he keep on get her pregnant, get her four C-section she won't get. Left to death. And you see him when I go to her, tell her, say she breed up and have four pitney and she had no memory. That's why she had no self-esteem. If Shantia come on my house, she cannot stay. You understand me? She cannot stay. You are called on her phone if you're not there here. So she go to jail. She can pack up and come up with like you. Yeah. If you got Shantia, you have to ask him. You have to call him and ask him. I would like to know what else is left. What else is the JCF waiting on? And the first set of police them from CIB and Matilda's corner that had the case. Who no need to tell we what was the problem? Why is it that we never deserve justice? Because I who put me through this. If we did do no job in the first place, it would have not been so difficult. The man asked if, the, if the marriage was legal. We don't know. We don't we, know. We don't see one like paper. We don't see a picture. Never see a picture. We don't know. All we sit down and do when we call, we're um, we're working on the matter, we're investigating the matter. Nothing. I am sick and tired of this country. And if I could leave this place and I thread, me take out my pitney, I'm gonna leave. Kinda sick me. Jamaica Constabulary Force, Jamaica's justice system, sick me. Cause you could have done better. And because of negligence, because of negligence, when you give me one head skull and piece of bone, because of negligence. I'm gonna want barely. And put it come tell we why it is that it never occur to uno to go check the surveillance camera. You understand me? I me need the person them will go up at the Bella's gate go check the remains. Why uno left the chapalin up there? Oh no call and go to that instruction. They said left the chapalin up there. Oh, is it because the chapalin has fingerprints? Yeah, is it because the chapalin has fingerprints, or is it because? It have little blood in there and forensic can be done on it. Why? Or you can be led back to someone's home. What is it? Because what you take with a fool, you know? You don't take with for one big puppy show. Sure. I should tell them so we are dopey. Can you think we are dopey? We are financial dopey, but we have brains. Listen, if people know Chantel when we were going to school, Chantel was a prefect. Them used to call Chantel Angel and call me she devil. She got the Portia Simpson Award when I graduate. You remember, say Portia Simpson give her the award the upper um, um, Ginger Ridge Primary. You make me forget? Yep. Okay. And it's Chantel, it's Chantel, not, she not even talk. She don't even talk. You understand me? And I would like the Jamaica Constabulary first to tell me, is it that you don't have a suspect or do you have a suspect? And if you have a suspect, who is the suspect? What is the secret? What is the secret? 
because she and you could have hired PI and lawyer to prove your innocence, but you did absolutely nothing to find your to wife. Find your wife. And you got to tell my grandmother about your glad you come out of the family here. Yeah. What do you mean by Two that? Day after she Two days after, after she went missing. You're, you're, glad, you're, you're glad she come out of the family here. Yeah. All of them something they are set out of your mouth. But people can attest to. And it is of no substance. Because you can say and do anything. Because you know that the justice system will back you. When we were in school, Chantel was the best student. Yeah. Chantel not give problems. She not give talking. I remember that very clear Ginger Ridge Primary School. Yeah, she got the Porsche City some minutes. Hours. You understand? <laughs> Chantel and I were inseparable. Inseparable before she meets Shane McCullough. The moment, the very moment Chantel meets Shane, that was it between the two of us. Remember one time I went overseas and I came back. I'm going to say I miss her to my core because I heard that she was pregnant. I'm going to call her and I said to her, I say, I can't come look for you. You know what she said to me? She had to go ask Shane. And I was torn into a million pieces. Nothing, nothing. But me realized I had to be the bigger person because none of what she was doing was her own will. None of what she was doing was her own will. So I took it upon myself to be the bigger person. Because I saw that she was manipulated, she was brainwashed, and there's a lot of things that she was forced to do. I would like to draw your attention to the fact and I would leave it where it is after I said that. When um, Shane stated that someone was hacking her credit card and stole the money and she was going to um, put press charges, charging. press charges against the person. My sister sent an email to the bank stating that she is not pressing any charges against anyone. And based on my understanding, the same Thursday morning that email was sent, at the same Thursday morning, my sister, quote unquote, went missing. So, you realize, say, she now personal charges and you now get back your money, but the insurance did the fear get. So you understand? Bitch, and it pain in your soul. So, because you know, say, oh, me make sure say me mash up the relationship there between the family, you know. So, them I go just run with what me have to say. You, know, you got it twisted. You got it twisted. You got it twisted. When people when 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 people um giving reports, you have a call talk but say people are in pharma. What do you mean people are in pharma? What if there's nothing to inform about? What do you mean people are in pharma? You move your office gone from one location to the next. Where you run for? What are you hiding from? What are you hiding from? Jamaica need a better everything. Because the people then where we have in authority and the people we have in high esteem and holding high esteem, the people then where we trust for have we back are the people them we are said we would for little or nothing. We forgive Chantel for everything we should do. Don't you she ain't? Everything that Chantel has done to us, we are forgiven her. We are forgiven her, baby girl. We're not holding nothing against her because we know it wasn't her. <laughs> I'm a whoop Shane, I listen. Miss Jackie with a big church out style mouth, Shane. Miss Jackie has forgiven Chantel for everything that the Lord her to do to me. I have forgiven my child. That's my baby. Dirty Shane, that's my baby. You kill me, pitney, I'm a dog, near me, pitney, drunk, girl. 
You kill me, pick me, that near me, pick me, can't sleep at night time. But as a member of the woman, says so she's in flesh. I come in here at night time in I dog mode. Don't you think in shame? You make that knee have me pick me. I hope you're rotten in hell. I hope you commit suicide. That you not have no possibility to see God. To reconcile with God. Germs. Who owe me a bury me pick me? Who me a bury me pick me? Who owe me a bury me here and put on pretty frog for me pick me and bury me pick me shame. After you give me skull and bone. When me a do burn her on top of your torch and shame. I hope you're rotten in hell. I hope you're rotten in hell. And I hope when you get incarcerated, you commit suicide. Because I'm not feeding in a prison either, germs. <laughs> and I want to know the Minister of Agenda Affairs, the Honorable Prime Minister, the Minister of Justice, the, 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 the Assistant Commissioner, me I ask you no, if you no sleep at night time, you no think about the family of Chantel Blake. And me I beg you no people, if you no can do better, no call her Makala. Please. If you no can do better, no mention Please. Makala. Makala, do something to me. Please. You understand? Me I ask me, Minister of Wholeness, me I ask the Minister of Gender Fears, I remember when politics are going on with Mr. Bob Zimmy, I said, big up yourself, Bob Zimmy. Jesus Christ, come out to my rescue. Come out to my rescue. We need help. We desperately need help. I'm not going to say, I'm she had killed my grand pitney them. Because she had to commit suicide if I last thing in do. I see it now, my spirit from there once she's going to kill himself. I have to kill himself. You have to kill yourself. She don't believe in a God, you know. When we start to shell, say, she, you must throw tight. She's a mistrucky. For what? She don't believe in a God. So we know say have to commit suicide. Me I ask the four of them, the Honorable Prime Minister, Minister of Justice, the one after that, and the Honorable Gender Affairs Minister, me I beg you, please help me. Help me! Me have a sick psychiatric evaluation. Because me mad. You understand? Me have to take sleep aid. Me have to take sleep aid because me can't sleep. Me I drive and me and when me park me car, me car, me come out of me car, me car run go on the road left me. Me have to stop drive. Me a law abiding citizen. So why me have to go through this and me never kill me picnic? I ask you to help your family. And make this justice serve. Because if she and the son are going to lock him up more in himself, and I'll let work for you all away. Because trust me, you don't have no problem with him. Once you call him in if you arrest him, he won't kill himself before he reach. And you can take that to the bank, because I know the guy. The guy is a coward. People that like to flaunt money are cowards. Anybody like to flaunt money are cowards. Strong people use their voice. People that flaunt money are cowards. And if Mr. Puri and Mr. Bailey had did their job initial stage, Shane would have confessed because he's a baby. Shane cries for everything. He shall tell them to share him all. And that's why he couldn't go look on the remains because he could have torture him. And Chantel was a missing person. No, she's a murder person. So I'm going to say, oh, long. We have to take 50, 50, 50, 50, 50. And if, if, if she's not guilty, I want the, the relevant um, 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 persons to let me know, Mrs. Gordon, he is not a suspect. He has, uh, he has, he has a clear line because he is all about that much. Let me know. Because as far as we know from this investigation, start, me don't hear nobody appoint no else. You know, when me sit down and me look back, I me think about the whole scenario. I may say, then this real, me see them always talk about them something upon news. People always share them something upon news. But when you come at your doorstep, you have to ask God, then this real, 
I knew that when I went to Bella's Gate that Sunday evening and I saw the body bag with the piece of it's called and the piece of bone, me need them weak. And I knew it was Chantel. But you see, when the reality lick you for no say you never did wrong, you were right all along. And then make it look like you're stupid. Shane, not even the four pitting them, you couldn't use for spare our life. Why you never did just strip her? Why you never just pack her up and carry Not even pack her up. Carry see him like how you drag her up a cold back for your anniversary. Make people have to set here, say a peep, a woman, people pick me. I make sure I jump one. I make sure I jump one. Why you never draw her go up a ginger age? Where you get her from? Why you never did just drag up a ginger ridge where you get her from? Make we fix her up. Make we fix her up. You get a whole person. Innocent. And you give it back piece of head skull and piece of bone. And it's system. It's system. They're behind you. Back in your on that. Let me tell you something. Man may feel we. I mean, let me tell you something. Me not go tell no lie. Me not even know how to pray because the, I am so upset. Me not even know the first word to say to God. But tears are our language and God understands. I mean, no, me not have to talk because they know my heart. But Shane, you see, you and your whole family, and if friend them and the work of them we have back of you are back here, me say, El Fire go come up on Uno. Me say, Una go want dead and can dead. Una go beg God for take Uno and God not take Uno. Because every pain want to put this family through, and them four people in the through, Una go feel it back to the core. Because God not sleep. You see how your friend crash and dead what right there? Your best friend just crash and dead out of the blue? Eh? You see how your best friend just crash and dead out of the blue? Now play with God, Pickney. Now play with God, Pickney. And he made dead with way him know. Your friend made dead with way him know. But others are alive and know it. And let me tell you something. Gotta go punish you no feet. Gotta go punish you no feet. Things that got me to now, now I gotta wonder why. Because them ya yeah, water ya. Them ya prayer ya. Yeah, now seven go down injury. Every day for seven months. Every single day for seven months. And we about. will continue to cry. And pray. Every look, me I go look on them for a pitney day. Me I go continue to cry because Chantel no deserve this. All you did need for do a pack her up. Drag her carry her come back up at Ginger Age. Make we fix her. Remember one time we go over there in the chef and Jaddy and said to him, said Daddy, you are good. Make sure you not come back come come and come 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 cause mommy and beat mommy no can grandma there and no grandma there. That's why he made sure he separated and made grandma was of the past. Mm -hmm. He made sure grandma not there on. Because he knew what saying couldn't be when grandma around. And you and, 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 and know want her to have it so she can call nobody. And that's the first time I abuse ladies out there. Me and beg you know, anytime you know, see them, I try to separate you know, from family and friends. I don't want to you know, have no friend. I don't want to you know, go walk. I abuse them, I abuse you know. People feel walk. Chantel went to, um, with that school and name up on John's, John's Road. Um, that, that Willow Dean. Willow Dean Primary, right? Aye, Willow Dean High. And she was teaching there. And she said to her, I said, Shan, when you pay this a little money, that's how you can go draw. And bring back a little girl who won't go sit down. And then he tell him, say, in just sit down and I get hand out. You wicked cocksucker. No, you don't kill me. me no, you don't kill me. Come kill me. I mean, no, me know my life in a danger, but guess what? I have some money like a Portland Credit Union where you can bury me.
But if me I go dead to get justice to my pity and my grand pity them, I don't mind. Me only want God fix me up before no take me. Because that's my child, that's my baby. When, 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 when me and Ab Shepherd and Shantel the 27th of September, and me and Bev alone did it, and God. And when Shepherd come out and me ready to go near me KFC, Shantel was left inside. And when Shantel come out, Shantel not breathing. And God spear her, she and you take her, Mr. God. God spear her. They had to run with her and put her in an incubator and do all kind of stuff with her because she wasn't breathing. And God spear her life. For 16 or 17 years, I take my baby and kill her. You are God. You are God. But I heap up a, whole, a, 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 a heap up a pile of fire coal for your head. And I go pray for your death today and stake you in your bed and you're not dead. So what you have put me through, Shane, I, I cry for seven months. Every day for seven months. Me take pills like I don't know which pills to take. When I get paper for the hospital, I look for the top of mental health and everybody that knows Jackie knows that Jackie is well and good and in her head space. And I feel like I got mental health now, Shane, because of you, Mr. God. I decree and declare suicide upon you, Shane. You shall commit suicide, Shane. You shall have no lot nor part with God. You, cannot, you shall have no reconciliation with God. I declare suicide upon you. And I hope God open the eyes of the Jamaica Constabulary Force and rescue JC and Josiah and Jadine and Jada before you commit suicide. Because I don't want you to hurt them any more than you already already hurting them. And, and so P, I hope your memory problem come back. Yeah. I hope your memory problem come back because I remember say she did with you. I mean, beg shame to make you come back and yard. And all of a sudden, you have memory problem. When the police are questioning you have memory loss, I hope your memory loss come back because you're going to need to remember some stuff. <laughs> when we ask him, which part him go after him let have Chantel a whole other? He's saying, go by him father go carry chicken. And the same amount of chicken. And the same, same amount of chicken. What's so carried on at the same amount of chicken the in the fridge? A shantel like chicken when you go up there. Yeah, I chicken. Shantel like chicken when you go up there. <laughs> God, you see and you know say it is too much. You see and you know say it is too much. Yes, they're my demons because they love to tell us to stay home, stay home, stay home, don't work. And that's the first time of abuse. I want to be independent, but I want my independence. And Sh Chantel, Chantel is way smarter than Chevelle in a book. She don't street smart, she don't suck a dopey. But she's way smarter than Chevelle in books. And can I tell you how oh, proud I am? At Come out too late for her. Tap chat rubbish and me Come out too late for her. Come out too late for her. I have several friggin' months now me a chat. Where I come talk about come out too late? Uh, Listen, if you ain't gonna for good fisher, come out for this. When I say come out too late? Me never know how. But lady, you come out too late. Come out late, too late for what? Come out too late for what? Me have a right for trust in the justice system. Because of that them they have to do. Come out too late for what? Where I say? Come out for this. Where I say? Something wrong if me sit down and I wait upon the Jamaica justice system for do what they are promised and to do what they are told and to do problem, and what they are called to do. Organist, we give you an opportunity to do to prove yourself and when you have proven failure then we talk about failure. Exactly. Am I supposed to say they are not good and I haven't tried? Exactly. You better wash your pussy. I'm an old man. You never know. We sit down and we are wait for the JCF to do them work. The first time we went on social media, we are compromising the case. And as far as me concerned, I barely and put it compromise the case. The whole of Matilda's corner police and the whole of CIB compromise the case. As far as me concerned. So many you come tell me about lady, you come out too late. Remember so we talked to Ashantina, Shachard, Anna, and then when we had another interview with the other guy, the, uh, the police then start the area, we said we now go back and something. We gave them an opportunity to prove themselves. I never just back down on them. I want to feel safe in my country and know that I can trust the system. 
And that is why I didn't come out with a big old mouth. Because I trust the system. You feel like say you feel like say a money couldn't spend too? You feel like say a nice could make too? You feel like say we couldn't get people nervous too? We are gonna trust the justice system because I'm not them there for do. And when you feel we know, no, we talk about failure. Because we can't talk boldly with what me say. I mean, I tell no yeah. life for nobody because I know what me say. saying. I know what I'm saying. You don't have to say nobody so when we try you feel. and you know yeah, work. Then me I got talk. They say me so I can talk. Me not go, me not work on this. You need to go find something for do. Me need the JC to tell you which part she ain't there and which part the picnic them there and who are going to happen to my niece and my nephew them. And let me tell you this again for the hundredth time. If you don't sit down, pound the ass and make she and hurt my nieces and my nephew, you are not going to be held accountable for it. Because we don't have a lot of questions to answer to. And Puri and Bailey have got to start answer them sooner or later. Let me tell you this. Come here, go show you say Chantel of corruption. Anybody will know, we know that too. The money will pay a private investigator. I mean, no, say she ain't not going to put it that and Bailey that. Exactly. Because they don't need more than $1,000. Because when they, when they pull you over on the road, I don't go get a ticket. All they want is a drink. All they want is a drink. All they want is a drink. Something for yourself now. Hungry set of people them. Low life people them. I ahead. When I tell them take me out thousand dollars ahead, I say chop off on my head. Because two of them and I want thousand dollars alone. You know, it not take much. Shit. It does not take much. I say one day now, one day she'll come there and say, from, but something happened, I will have by one accident. Nobody no need to celebrate no 60th, 60th anniversary of corruption. I, I, I demonstrate, I demonstrate. 60th anniversary of, of corruption, corruption before so I mash you up. Like the flank. We don't know before some mash 60th anniversary of corruption. We don't take people life for play a play something. You understand me? We don't take people life for no. We don't only see people that want to can get hands out from. We don't only see the people that we can get answered from. Of course he has the keys. Who we have them? Every time I ask the police, whether police are work with me or I work against me, every police officer that I'm in dialogue with, and that has always been my concern, because we can't see Chantel life again. Yeah. We are worried about Chantel the kids then. From the get -go. We are worried about room, the kids. When I walk in that room at that autopsy, I felt my belly button move and I know I'm a pick me that. So I just start worrying about my four grand pick them when I don't think they're dead. And the police said to me, they don't know as far as they know the people they're missing to. Exactly. So the police don't know where they're The need police don't know where they're missing to. They don't know, know how Mr. Shane Makara is so untouchable. And, and the email that Shantel sent me clearly says that Jada despises you. But yet still, the Jamaican government and authority allow Shane to have a child in his custody that despises him after his mother is missing. After her mother is missing. You know, tears good, you know, feel good, and you know, good. <laughs> Mr. Me, if you say I don't even like to see the Jamaican flag and people that knows me know say me a die at the Jamaican. Mugala foreign, I say nobody talk about my country, you're mad. Don't talk about my country and my people, no matter what they foot dirty and in crying. But movie me tell you what they say, what they are my day at work and what I'm a friend say, come with me care about the movie. I'm a god the movie movie and I said national anti my play and I sit down. Me not standing up. Mr. Chevelle, I went me to not the standing up. Big the Marco Award ceremony. And that because you know say me in a, me 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 up on board and me have to behave properly. And me say me stand up on the national and all the time I sing and me say me tense, me tense, me want caca, me want pee pee, me want do everything. Me, uh, me die for national and them done. Come on, me say say true risk and sh true respect for all. And sir, respect to duty call. Which one my duty call? <laughs> Serve respect to the affluent people them. The people them we have the social background and the but status. Like saying, say, oh Canada. Or oh Satan, you see. And that me feel like seven times Jamaica and them are saying, I'm gonna stick my tongue up. Because I'm gonna make people act out of their character for justice after I pay my tax money. And, do, and pay, pay taxes so I can pay you. I'm gonna still make me have to come on social media and act out of my character. I say, Mummy, when I say we are going to do the protest, and I think about it, I say, but after Chantel, I have no friend. I say, but after Chantel, I have no friend. Like, this man makes sure I say, he makes sure I separate Chantel from everybody. 
and the JCF now have no intelligence whatsoever. So Chantel friend said to me, say, Mommy, no intelligence whatsoever. Chantel friend said, Mommy, the guy said, Mommy, don't feel bad. Chantel tried to reach out to you. She tried to reach out to you. She had mash up the phone man, one morning and said, Everything you talk about, call your mother. Shane said to Chantel, a worthless married woman called her mother before 6 o'clock in the morning. Facebook, me and Chantel on the phone every morning. I went in a competition, porridge competition or breakfast competition. And I said, where are you for them pick? And she said, nuggets. Now I put a lettuce and tomato side of the marker nuggets to make it spice it up and then I show her. And she said, mommy, you have to go on too much. He didn't like that. He didn't like that he told her that I was with married woman called her mother before 6 o'clock in the morning. Mommy, my mama, me tell you now. Me set you say, me set you say, and you can't do nothing, Shane. You can't, mommy, tell you this. You can't do nothing. You might kill Chantel, but you can't do it no. Let me tell you this. The blood of Jesus cover we. You can't do it no. no. I me a cramp and paralyze every plan where you have. Every plan where you have your demons, friends, them have. I cramp and paralyze, and I send it back to you. In the name of Jesus. Cramp it and paralyze it because you can't touch God, people. Let me tell you this. I me a strip you off of the power where you think say you have. That's you feel like say you go walk scotch free now this. Let me tell you, me a strip you off of the power and the authority where you feel like you have. And the back it where you feel like you have. Because all of them have to surrender. I me a start off with the two police them where you pay. I mean I ask no question. I go start off with the two of them where you buy out. That's how I go start. Come on, if you know why basic, basic things was not done in the initial state. Is it that you're not capable? Is it, or is it that you just never want to do the work? Which one? Are you were paid to do otherwise? Y'all come tell me, boss, say you tell Shane McCullough to get liar. Like I think some are dopey. You feel like some can't read and write? I mean, an intelligence. Who does that? Which police do that? You know, tell me some time, you know, after you don't question him and get where you can get out of him. You prove, you, you prepare him, get a lawyer and come in. Every time that we ask about the kids, we cannot do anything about the kids because he's their legal guardian. That is definitely understood. But no, my sister, it has been confirmed that she was murdered. You understand me? And based on my understanding and based on the millions of people in this world understanding, there's only one finger pointing. So me would I like to know how long it's going to take the JCF to take my niece and nephew out of this man's custody. Because if you sit down on the backside and make sure you hurt none of my niece and nephew, them, it now goes so. I tell you that. Enough is enough with Uno. Enough is enough with Uno. The poor people them good, they traumatize. The poor people them good, they wonder what is going on. Auntie, I'm calling. I say, Auntie, I come over here today. Remember every day they call. Auntie, I come over here today. And then I'm sitting in the room. When they see me, I show me the protest. The protest. The protest has been postponed because persons would like to be a part of it, and for some, it was a very short notice because this was something that we just came about yesterday. This is giving the JCF time to make it public to let us know what is going on. And if we not get a public response, listen to me. Chevelle and Marie Blake, I'm going to station a CIB. When I've got call NSWMA, they move me from CIB. Sick and tired, I know. Because when everybody else gets tired, and as much as though sometimes I just feel like I just want to call it a day because me a human being. And sometimes I feel powerless. Sometimes I feel like I say, nah, gone away. I mean, nobody if you help me. Come me just a talk, 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 and then I'm going away. Somebody asked him about CDA. CDA say you need an address. CDA say I need an address for where the kids are. I can't provide an address because I don't know where them there. I don't know where the kids are. So I could not provide an address. But I want to know what is gonna be done now. You understand me? If that it is that we are gonna, is it that Jesse if I go we are city we are gonna have five smarty for Barry? I they don't like, mean what for no. Five. They like when you have Barry, Barry all in five. Because if you're killing people, them mother, what you wouldn't do to them? What you wouldn't do to them?
May I go say one last thing before me go. And I said this before, I may I go say it again. If I could leave this country on a thread, I would take my child and I would leave this place. And anybody I have listen, nothing. Anybody listen and know how we can reach out to one foreign country, whether it be Cuba, Africa, America, India, Sri Lanka, Nicaragua, Honduras, anywhere that I can um, ask for, 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 seek asylum for me and my family, or not make we know because I don't want to be here. After me name Chantel remains, I want to be exited out of this place. We can't allow the JCF to bring another family through this. We cannot allow the first set up. I'm not even going to say the JCF in this case. Because MID is a part of the JCF. I'm going to tell you the God Almighty truth. The team try. But the first set of police, them will have the case. And them cause the problem. And them are going to say, we. We are compromising the case. When all they did was to compromise the case from day one. what else do you need what else is there what kind of evidence what kind of adequate more evidence in one you understand what else do you need enough is enough enough is enough and Andrew Owness I had the head of this country you need to answer to questions and give people justice. Uh, she like not you. just the poor. She and I like feel like she, she ain't like you. 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 Because you're a criminal. She ain't like you. She ain't fall when you win. Let me tell you that. A trick she ain't trick on her. Nobody came out to us and said anything. No condolence. Nobody came out to us and said anything. Because Chantel life no matter. Well, listen, I am not going to stop. And she and you get one thing wrong because I know so when you kill Chantel, you did feel like so we're going to jump on the bandwagon with you and say, oh, she run away. You got it so much so twisted because you don't understand the part. You see, she ain't no blood. You don't understand the part. We say blood thicker than water. And the moment me hear so Chantel missing, me not even remember. Me not even remember say me and I never have a the good girl was good sacrificed. note. He is in a cult. Of course he's in a cult. Of course he's in a cult. That is why he's unstoppable. I went by the house one day and Shante said to me, Chevel, you believe in a cult? You believe in a obia them wicked something there? Me say it is real, but I don't believe in it because believe kill and believe cure. And she said to me, say, sometimes I look and she and him look like the demons. And I said, take up yourself and go back to church and carry a pit in them if him don't want to come. That's exactly what I said to her. Where me need to go? They say Canada will take me. I went to school in Canada. Which part me need to go to Canada take me? Because as soon as me now I try to tell the school and the coupies are born them, me don't want to be here. Jamaica is an animal country. It, the, the place I need to be one desert island where they just send down animal down here. And people find place for go go raise them family and live them good good life. I be an animal need to live here. Dog, drunk, or ag, or pig. Be an animal for doing so. Sick, sick and tired of the place here. Yeah. Because if you don't have money, and if you don't have status, and if you don't have the wrongs, nobody no count you. Nobody no count you. Nisi and safety takes her after. You see? You know? Mm, me look three. Somebody said they have all. Never have I imagined in a million years say my sister. Me know said data for everybody, you know. Me know said data for everybody. But you take her shame. 16 year old just come out of high school you separate her from we you get her pregnant four times four c-section and when enough wasn't enough 
You take her and you go kill her left dog for your man. Go kill her left dog for your man body. Britney tell me, Britney, 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 Yeah, they wanted us to be silent because nobody no count we. Nobody no count we. Because we now go pay up no money and we now go call out nobody out of their name. But enough is enough. I mean, I tell you no lie, I was fooled. Because me did take Mr. Mr. Fitzbailey word for it when he said to me that he's going to investigate the case. It's not something that he does personally, but he's going to take this up personally. But I mean, never waste my time. But. Chantel life matter too. And I'm going to end by saying. I will never stop. Sometimes I do get weary. Sometimes I cry. Sometimes I cry. Sometimes I feel like I'm dead. Dead. Because me, I wonder what Chantel do for deserve this. Nothing. Nothing. But because when I have the social background, and because when I have when I have the money for pay them off, or because when I, when I, when I decide to pay them off, you understand me? There's no justice for those set of people. Because your status speaks to what justice you get in the country of Jamaica. Thank you all for the support. Thank you all for the prayers. Thank you for the encouraging words. Really appreciate it. I'll just keep you guys updated whatever is going on because it's only here so we get help. And the protest is still on. The Jamaica Constabulary Force have time to give us some answers, but the protest is still on. And the protest is not for is not just for this to go public, but I feel it reach far and abroad. Because them sister and the people them with them under need to know that this is a place we need to pack up. This is not a just country. This is not a just country. And people when I have money and people when I have status, life matters too. I break blood through for everybody too. And I blood run through with you. I'm tired. I'm tired. From yesterday, it's like this thing gone right back to square one for me. This thing gone right back to square one for me. From I, from I get up out of the bed this morning with my mother, I don't taste. You try, but you couldn't do it. I'm tired. I'm a disappointed. And I am ashamed to call myself a Jamaican citizen. I am ashamed of my nationality because there's no justice. And as much as our America racist, this could have never happened in America. Never. But justice will be served. And justice must be served. So she and followers with the pandis. And she and workers with the pandis. And she and families with the pandis. When they can't go tell himself to make use of him freedom. And Jamaica Constabulary Force. If you sit down and make she and hurt my nieces and my nephews. You will be held accountable for it. And mark my words on the 30th of July 2022. If it's the last thing me do. Because uno, somebody need to jerk uno. Uno need some shaking up. Have a good day guys.